they come to Jesus and they ask Jesus for mercy yet Jesus doesn't give them healing like with others where Jesus would touch a person and immediately leprosy will leave Jesus doesn't speak a word and says be cleansed like he did with others Jesus doesn't lay his hands upon them so that the leprosy leaves he actually tells them as we've read in verse 14 he says go and show yourselves to the priests and the scripture says that they didn't even ask any questions what about our healing what about our leprosy but see they knew Jesus knew what they wanted they trusted that Jesus knew their intentions and Jesus knew their problems and the Bible says as they walked it's interesting that not when Jesus spoke not when they arrived but as they walked they were cleansed I have a word for somebody this morning there's times when God heals right on the spot but there are times when you take a step by step in faith and you notice the problem you had before you have no more there are times when deliverance happens when you are on the prayer line or when you're laying your hands and you're praying with the minister the man of God through YouTube or through Emmanuel TV but there are certain things that as you walk with God as you take step by step every single day in faith you will begin to notice some chains falling off some cleansing happening as you walk by faith there are blessings we get when we come to Jesus but there are other things we get by walking in faith I've had healings in my life I've had breakthroughs in my life but most of them not all most of them happened as I walked I've had encounters with God where I would feel his presence in a way that I cannot describe but rarely they happened in the service most of them they happened as I walked I know a lot of people who exactly the same way and they could testify today that as they walked God started to cleanse their life I value prayer lines I value men of God or the atmosphere where Holy Spirit's presence moves mightily I value worship experience where you lift your hands and you feel literally goosebumps going through your body I value those moments where on Friday night when I was at the camp in Salem and about 11 people came to testify of instant healing that they received while we were praying and they started to share that as as we were praying heat was going through the painful parts of their body that is so wonderful I value those moments but I also know a man of faith lives by faith walks by faith and your miracle might not happen in an instant it might happen as you walk don't underestimate the importance of your process don't underestimate the importance of your walk with God.